All right, so I've got a My Trainer Bob challenge for you. It's gonna be the dumbbell snatch. You're gonna need a dumbbell. Don't be afraid of something heavy. I'm gonna have Roxy use an eight pound. You can try going up to 15 pounds if you're feeling really strong, but I'm gonna keep you at eight right now. But before you lift the weight, I'm gonna show you your position. I want you to think about your chest staying up nice and tall as if there was a wall right in front of you. I want you to reach your right arm down and then come up, reach the arm all the way overhead. Now hold it right there. What I wanna see is a straight line all the way down your body. A lot of times in this position, some people want to really drive the hips a little bit too far forward. They might want to stick your chest out. All you want to think about is a good straight line. Do it again without the weight. And up, reach. Good. When you have the dumbbell in your hand, what you really want to think about is all the strength coming from your hips. So you're going to come down and then straight up. Reach down and up. That's the form. If you've never done this before and you want to do it without weights, that's fine. But Roxy, she's going to do it with weights. So go ahead and pick it up. We're going to do 30 on each side. You got me? Show, show me good form. Come down, pop up. Strong here, come down. Good. I want you to have that pause up on the top just for a second so you real, your body really engages. And down. Okay, start. Three. Remember, give me that one little pause up on the top, just about a second or two to show me that you do have that position. You're using every bit of your muscle strength in your whole entire body. Athletes work from their hips. I really want you to think about hips driving that weight up. Reach high, keep the head up. Remember, positioning is very important. Go back to thinking if there's a wall in front of me, I'm not gonna hit my head on the wall. I wanna stay up tall, reach up. We're doing 30, what number are we on? 17. 17. Reach. This is a great cardiovascular exercise. Try throwing these snatches in when you're doing any kind of weight training. You're going to keep your heart rate up and that's going to keep you calorie burning. Good. Up. Reach. High. Stand up nice and tall, Roxy. You're not tired. Your abs are engaged. What number? 27. 28. 29. One more. And go ahead and switch sides. You don't need to have a break. You can go right into it. Keep that arm straight though, Roxy. Reach that left arm all the way up, up. Keep your shoulder right in your socket. I don't want to see any of this. I want to see you planted down. I want to see your abs in real strong. Keep your abs engaged. Reach high, up high, good. When you get those squats going, you're going to feel your heart rate coming up. Your heart rate up, Roxy? Good, what number? 14, you're almost done. 30 on each side. Look at that. Up. Strong. What number? 18. 19. All right. We have 10 more. Reach. I want perfect form in these, Roxy. Keep that arm nice and straight. Lift. Use your hips. Drive with your hips. Fly up. What number? 27. 27. 28. Two more. Last one, and relax. Drop that weight down to the ground. It's very important when you're doing these that you really think about your hips. All your force is coming from your lower body, and that arm just glides up. And then you get into that locked position, and you keep your shoulders down, and you keep your abs engaged. That is your dumbbell snatch challenge. Great job, Roxy.